Get right, son. Apparently butlers don't like fire. So, fun fact, my first time playing through this game, it took me hours to figure that out. I mean, you just got the fire element and he has a candle thing with I didn't candle. realize there was a floating candlestick in the hallway. How did you not realize that? I didn't. How? I don't fucking know. They don't understand, Tim. I don't understand either, Cassandra. Let me vacuum up the towels. Stop it, game. There we go. Also, that door's fake. See? I can fire it and it disappears. It's fake. But anyway, we got a ghost to deal with. So yeah, no, um, did you explain about the fake doors already? Nope. <laughs> you can do that while I... Alright, so, while well, Cassie gets ready to wreck this ghost shit. Um, some of the doors in the hallways aren't real doors. They're actually troll doors there to fuck your day up and fuck your shit. So what happens is when you try to open a fake door, the door will smack the shadow of Luigi, damaging Luigi, and yeah. Oh, no, I got one. You got the poison mushroom out there. I don't know if I can get the big crawl. You'll, you'll get it. They don't disappear. Do they not? I'm so cute and little, though. Yeah. Crawls won't disappear. Thank goodness. But, um... Ah, shit, just dropped my phone. Good ass. job. Thank goodness, what phone? No, you? go stay, come back here. So. Not getting away from me this time. <laughs> so, as I was saying, the way that the fake doors work is when you're walking down the hallway, you will see that the real doors have carpets under them. Fake doors do not. As well as fake doors when sucked on by the vacuum do not shake. Where real, do real doors will. And lastly, but certainly not least, you can destroy fake doors by lighting them on fire. If you actually walk into the fake doors, though, it will make you lose HP and make you lose money. And uh, we don't like losing money. Well, I thought I said that they smack you if you go into the fake doors. Well, I, I didn't realize you said that because I wasn't listening because I was too busy avoiding the purple mushroom. <laughs> also, secrets, yeah. There's two secret rooms in this game. That's still unfair. Um, this is the hidden room. And you have to come here during the blackout. Okay. There's a spirit of speedy nature here. Setting them on fire. Yeah, there's certain ghosts that you need specific elements to actually defeat. Because they want, they're like, we gave you this gimmick, now use it. The game is nice enough, though, to never put you in a situation where you cannot deal with a ghost. Yeah. If you encounter it, you can clearly fight it. Well, not always. Sometimes you forget to have the right element and you have to go back and get it. But they usually give you a way to get it in the room, though. No. Not always. That is a lie. I found that out the hard way. That's not always the case. Most of the time it is the case, and usually it's pretty obvious if you need it, but... Sometimes... Sometimes no. If it's not immediately in the room, they usually get to very close by. Yeah, it's usually close by in very rare occasions. Do you have to go out of your way to actually find it? But yeah, this is two, one of two secret rooms in the game. The other one is much later on. So yeah, I almost want to make the um, Foster's Home reference and just be like, secret door, secret door, secret door, secret door, secret door. <laughs> I mean, like, and for this one, you get a, a ruby, a sapphire, and, and an emerald. emerald. Yeah! Yeah, subtle Pokemon reference. Sort of. Sapphire was clearly the best of the three games, though. <laughs> clearly. Purely because of the color blue. More money. Did I get the one in here? There's just a heart in there. Why are there so many hearts? I like this game because of how simple it is. It is really simple. And it's fun for what it's worth. Aha, his name is Gumbo. Instead of Gumbo. <sighs> oh, your pain, it satisfies me so. Thingy. I mm. found a thing. You did find a thing. Just makes life easier. Yep, that's what the mirrors are for. How am I supposed to go now? I think I'm gonna... Gotta go play music! Yeah... 
Yeah. Gotta go do 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 all over the place. I'm sure Aaron would appreciate this room. Yeah, this room, this room is, this room is the hypest. So you gotta hit all the instruments and stuff. And then she plays along. She's my favorite ghost in this game. And Melody. She's a sweetheart. Except all the ghosts want to kill you, so... So there's one of... This is one of two different songs that she'll play, and you just have to guess the right answer. I actually think it's three. Is it three? I, I don't know. I actually don't know for a fact. I've heard that it's three. Yeah. I feel like I've only remembered two on top. I remember that. hearing this one and the Mario Bros. 3 athletic thing. Yeah. So you get her sheets and then you start doing the thing. And we good. Yep. Like a boss do. Yeah. Doing stuff. I realize certain things I say came from a YouTuber I used to watch years ago. I mean, yeah, that, that kind of happens. No. Well, like, you know how I'll say, like, like a boss do? Mm hmm That's from a YouTuber I used to watch. Who? Um, Paperback VG. He used to do, like, a ton of Minecraft stuff, and, like, he still does YouTube, but he's more of a Twitch streamer now, which makes oh, me okay. sad. I mean, it's not the worst thing. It's not, but I don't really care for him on Twitch, personally. Yeah, fair enough. Like, he's the reason I found out about League of Legends, actually. Oh, really? Yeah. Huh. No kiddins. Yep, paperback VG. Yeah, we are now here. I remember he actually made a rap song a few years back, and it was actually really good. Okay, so I believe there's a mousey in here. Yes, there is. And China Cabin on the left side. Oh, no, excuse me. I'm talking about the Speedy Spirit. Yeah. Well, is that here or during the blackout? No. You can get this one now. Yeah! Emerald! Cool stuff. Yeah. We're just gonna get this out of the way because it's gonna block my path otherwise. I believe there is a mouse in here though. Yeah, cheese! This is actually something I didn't know about until recently. That these were actually things in this game. The mouses? Yeah. Well, I knew about the mouses. I didn't know about the ones in the rooms, specifically. Wait, really? Yeah, that was one thing. Like, you talk about things you didn't know. That was one thing I never knew about this game going into it. Huh. So, this is one of the first optional ghosts in this game. Oh, I need to light his candles first. Now I can see him. And we're gonna steal his food because, dear God, he doesn't need any more. But he has little servants coming and we're gonna try to set him on fire. I think he's supposed to just set him up. Yeah. Oh, I need more fire. Does the fire actually do anything to them? Yeah, it makes it a hell, hell of a lot easier to actually kill them. I discovered this watching the speedrun. Too huge a difference, perhaps, but it doesn't even seem like it's doing anything, honestly. Eh. I saw it was a thing and I thought it was a thing. I just know I've had an easier time using fire against them at one point or another. But anyway, now that there's no waiters fucking our shit up. We can take this guy's food. 
And of course he appreciates that. <laughs> By shooting fireballs. That feels like a, it feels like an actual boss fight. Just gotta wait till he tuckers himself out. Christ. Yeah, I know. It takes a really long time for him to... Oh, no. Oh, that's bad. Alright, so... The gold is not out of the picture, unfortunately. Yeah. It makes me almost want to reset the game, but I'm not going to do that. I'll suck it up. Are you trying to get all gold rings? Yeah. But it's unrealistic to get all of them. Oh my god, this guy is such a pain. I'm gonna get freaking bronze on him. This is ridiculous. It's also this room, though. Because that table position is actually really annoying. Yeah. I'm just mad because usually I do way better on this guy. But I'm just not. You're not performing? Nope. Cassie's not performing up to her usual standards. Yeah. Because it's just really annoying. Because there's like so many things that can break it that it's just... It's hard for you to keep the tether. Yeah. It's really annoying. But yeah, he's dead now. Dude, we did it! 